Greetings friends and welcome to Enigma Night Gaming. My name is Liara and I will be your guide in today's adventure. Today we are once again playing World of Warcraft in the Pandaria Remix. Now this is a time limited event and time is running out. So we're going to try and see how fast we can level up and how far and close we can get to level 70. So without further ado, let's hop in. So the first thing that I want to do is something uh, supposedly this is supposed to help you level up faster if you don't loot in the dungeons um, then you get a whole bunch of stuff in your mailbox and um, there is also um, an add-on that uh, I was recommended to get. Supposedly, this add-on, Remix Mail Helper, will give us information about uh, what we've got. So it will show us uh, what our level is, what our cloak is, and um, what we need. So I guess we're going to make sure that our um, resto spec is up to date and then we're gonna run some some uh, dungeons so well, let's go ahead and hop on over to resto and update our spec all right so we have fixed up our talent points for restoration we have socketed all of our as close as we can get to best in slot uh, gems uh, for right now and we don't have any additional gear at this time so now I think we are ready to start queuing for some random uh, heroic time running dungeons right so and then we have our auto loot turned off so that all of the rewards will go to our mailbox in theory and um, and then we won't have to uh, and then supposedly the way this is supposed to work is you loot uh, after a certain point and you get enough stuff to hit 70. I, I don't know how far we'll be able to get we're level 39 right now so so, Temple of the Jade Serpent. I'm gonna go ahead and swap so that we have all of our lightning stuff right together, right? Well, that was an easy level 40. Unexpected. We've already started the boss encounter. It's all good. We'll just uh, drop a healing stream. Oh. I, I don't know. Can you attack him through his shield? I don't know. I can't do anything else from here. I suppose I could attack this over there. Let's go ahead and get some chain heals going. Very diminished, yeah. I've seen some people like kill him even when his shield was up. And I didn't even know you could attack him. I thought it was an immune shield. But yeah, it's just diminished. Let's see, we're killing him. That guy still hasn't gone down yet. I mean, I'm not gonna complain. It means you get to avoid the water spout phase, so. Alright. So, where are we going? I need to... Where did the tank go? He went up this way, right? Didn't he? he... Yeah, yeah, yeah. He went over this way. Okay. Alright. So, we're going to follow along. 
And I, I don't know if you're supposed to not loot anything, but I have auto loot turned off, so... Hopefully everything will come to the mailbox like it's supposed to. Maybe it only comes Watch off of step. bosses, which, you know, that's a possibility. This is completely an experiment. Shockwave. Alright, let's get some chain heals going on. Watch your step. Interrupt. Nothing lives long enough to interrupt, so... Your forces are weak. The heart of the Great Serpent will not fall into your hands. At least this dungeon Jade is really serpent, quick. Grant me strength! It goes fast. The cycle must continue. The Jade Serpent must be reborn! I wonder if there's a point on the last boss to, uh, I mean, I don't think I've even got heroism yet, so I guess it's a moot point at this, at this phase. But, we're just gonna Watch your step. head along. Alright. We're just, we're basically another DPS at this point. And we see how fast it goes. Alright, and then we don't loot, right? In theory. I guess you can loot, but I mean, there's no point because I have auto loot turned off. Alright. So we're gonna see if that sends stuff to the mailbox. I don't know. All right, there we go. The dancing for uh, this music, right? All right. Storm Stout Brewery. Oh, hello there. It's good of you to visit all the. All right, I'm gonna Storm pick up the quest and uh, for extra XP, and maybe we can read them as we go along. Let's see. All right, so. Our secret recipe. Uh, I was gathering them up, but then Hosen? Auntie looks very confused. How is Gal brewing anything? He needs those recipes or disaster is sure to strike. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my books. Because they are off. Off like a shot. Alright. Oh yeah, I might. I'm not even looting them. Whoops. That is one downside of auto loot being off. I gotta click on the book. Quest. That's okay. We'll get there. Alright. And we're not even gonna make it up to the boss before he dies. That's crazy. They go fast. Alright. We need to run. Hurry. Run along. Um, what is the other quest that we have? Let's see. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, that was Family Secrets. Trouble Brewing, I think. Alright. Uh, with the brewery infested by Hosen and... Who knows what else? I'm sure that the brewers are in trouble. Uh, would you mind going, helping me find out what's going on, friend? Alright, so pretty simple, straightforward quest. Man, they're just killing it. And this, uh, evoker doing crazy damage. What's it? Are they... Or, wait. What are they doing yeah, yeah, yeah. for elemental? Evoker. Man, it's an augmentation of Oka. That's you, amazing. Those are Usually they're lives. not the highest DPS, but... I can't even get a cast off before thing die things die. I'm literally just here for decoration, apparently. Yes, yes, yes. So close. Just a pinch of poops. That moment when the queue takes longer than the dungeon. 
Because this is already the last boss. That's crazy how fast it is. Everyone's just doing... That, that augmentation of Ogres is doing crazy damage. The last box takes, takes a little time. Yeah, only because you can't necessarily brute force it. You have to wait for all these guys to spawn and whatnot. But it's okay. Yes, yes. No, 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 no. Yes, no. Peppers. All right. I just can't. I can't believe how fast this dungeon is going, though. I'm already level 42. This is. I mean, granted, I do have a bunch of rested, but still, it's quite impressive. What is that thing? Ah, doesn't matter. Nothing will stop me now. Not what I'm. I don't know why I'm doing chain lightning. I should be doing normal. Wow. That's amazing. Such harmony of flavor. Such heavy aroma. It is the All right. perfect. Alright, we'll go ahead and turn in our quests. Need a storm stout. Oh, uh, hello. Once again. Uh, oh, so what's this? A go gal jiggles out. his fat brew belly this at the sight of the family's recipes. Ooh, I what knew I was adding too much corn. You again? Don't you see? I have made. A name for myself at last. I have brewed perfection. A giant creature course, made of brew? Who could have imagined such of a thing? Infested. You have my and thanks for saving Gal from his own misguided brewing experiments. In the main store. Look, Chen Stormstout. We all can't be heroes, running from our responsibilities, traveling <sighs> around the dread wastes, saving the world. Some of us are artists. <laughs> All right. Well, they're gonna have a difference I of opinions. I think the brewery might be on fire. <laughs> it's on fire. Yes, yes, that happens. Oh well, no big deal. The brewery's on fire. Oh well. Well, y'all have fun with that. <laughs> All right. So we have gained like three, four levels. So now, oh good. I'm so glad that we defeated the uh, second boss. Now, that's amazing. But now we have four more points to spend, so we're going to go ahead and do that real quick. Alright, so I keep going out the back door. So now we're going to check the mailbox. I'm not going to open anything, I want to see the add-on. So it's saying, uh, Cloak XP bonus is giving us 109% supposedly. And... And I'm not sure what all this means. I'm guessing that means that we need to get that much more stuff. So we're gonna queue right back up and we're gonna we're gonna keep going. That last dungeon was crazy fast. Like I can't believe how fast it was. Shadow Pan, another one Brothers, that we haven't done. Dispose of these insolent outsiders. The Shadow Pan need no outside aid. Remove All right, so we'll see if we can read the quest. I don't know. We also got to keep an eye on everybody. Let's see if we can find that quest. All right. Oh yeah, I can't do that. Um. So our Lord Tanzu has been overcome by a shah of pure hatred. The whole monastery has been lost. Shaman, you must find a way to free him of this possession. Last I knew, he was meditating in the grove of fallen blossoms. Right. Yeah, these guys die so fast, it's crazy. We can't even kill him that fast. charge me with your power. Alright. energy is strong. I really should be using this uh DPS power, but it's okay. Together. We now we build. run over here. I'm very curious like how long this dungeon will take. I feel like they're taking like five minutes. 
and we're almost through another level. So this is a pretty fast way to level, it seems. We'll see what the, the net gain is. Now, supposedly, there is an official way of doing uh, the whole don't loot your mail. Like, there's a, there's a whole formula for it, right? Like, you can, um, you, basically, you start at level 10, and then you run this dungeon, that dungeon, this dungeon, etc. Then you do this raid. Like, there's this whole formula you, that you can supposedly you level to 70 in, like, two hours or so. Reawaken after all but these I don't mind years. taking it a little bit more leisurely. If I mean, truly wish to undo what quick is good, have upon but there's nothing wrong with, uh, uh, enjoying the, the time as well. Where one falls, I just want to see how far place. we can get. So we were like level 39 when we logged in. So it's just going to be interesting to see where we end up being at the end of uh, this episode. Stand aside for your fellow uh, students. I mean, we've already gained what where four levels. Falls, another will rise. I mean, it is rested, place. as I stated, so. Not necessarily a super accurate gauge yet. You have bested our most junior of students. But that's okay. Now you will face. Two I mean, if we get to 50, senior. then that's only 20 oh. levels away from max level, so. Time to fight the next batch. So, like, we're very close. There's not much left on this dungeon either. Right, We've got so the two students to fight. Lotus. And then we have to fight uh, Master Snowdrift. And then it's the last boss. It's just getting to him. You have bested my prize students. Time to go. Perhaps you can be of use to us after all. Run. We're all like trying to get up. As my master Let me up. Said, you cannot truly know someone. I'm so used to playing my druid. Like I'm like, where's my war? So that we may be oh, yeah, I don't have that introduced. ability on my shaman. Alright. Very well then, outsiders. Well, Let uh, us see your true strength. See what we can do here. I'm still doing like next to no damage compared to the other guys. Oh yeah, I can't I can't loot, I forgot. I, I, it's it's difficult to fight that reflex, but at the same time, I just keep telling myself that this is just like a mythic plus. Because mythic, oh yeah, yeah, get the quest, thank you. All right, anyway, I, I am so like, just distracted by everything. Okay, we're almost out of rested. I will grab the quest. Oh yeah, there is one more boss. Totally forgot about that one, the Shaw. Run. All right, so I got to kill the the Shaw of Violence. You have proven yourself in battle. Still, if you would aid us further, I must ask something else of you. The Shaw of Violence awaits I beyond be within the sealed uh, chambers. Destroy it if you would earn my respect. We'll see if we can I even catch up to them you. to be able to do it. Oh, we got locked out. That's okay. That's okay. Hopefully it still counts. I think it is. We can just... Alright. Hey, count it. I mean, hey. I'll just... This isn't the shot anyways. But it's the one for the quest, though. But I got... I got... Credit, I think. So it's all good. I have like. I'm basically just here for the ride at this point. I am so getting carried. Oh, yeah. People need to do this. Oh, yeah. And we'll go around. Are they gonna jump off the bridge? They are. And we avoid fighting 
as many mobs as possible. I wish Ghost Wolf uh, had 100% speed, just like the other uh, classes. That would be nice. Where did these guys come from? have another thing that we've got to do. We've got to go click on, I assume. Because those guys came from over here. Somebody pulled them. So we got to click on these guys. I think I can't. I got to kill this thing. Now we can do it. All right. There we go. Now they're off. Alright. Avoid this group. And then, last boss! Alright, and I did like so much damage. Thank you, Shaman. I am cleansed of all hatred. Knowing that, uh, know that you are a hero of the Shadow Pan. Mm -hmm. the you have defeated the Shah of Violence and saved the, the monastery. monastery. You have my respect. Well. Perhaps we were wrong about your people, Nalanya. The Shadow Pan are in your debt. Now, all right. there is much work to be done. Now we are in Mogashan Palace. Welcome. I hope to see you As again per soon. usual, we'll grab the quest and read them as we get carried. Because nobody wants to wait for anyone and healing is optional. So now let's find our quests. So we can enjoy the story. Alright, let's see. Here we go. Oh, this one. This tank actually needs a little healing. Uh, let's see. The Mogu have reawakened and are a threat to all Pandaria. They are on the cusp of becoming even more dangerous. There are four great Mogu kings of legend. Zion, the English, uh, the Endless Shadow, Meng, the Demented, uh, I don't know how to pronounce this, Kang, the Merciless, and Subatai, the Swift. Four artifacts of these kings are secreted away in the vault of the king's past below. You must retrieve these relics before the Mogu discover them and become unstoppable. That would be bad. And then we also have... A new... Er, he single, a new king of the Mogu has arisen. It's in the Weapon Master. He single-handedly subjugated the Mogu clans, and th now they and their new leaders vie for his favor. I've never seen or read of any who are his equal in, in battle. Do not underestimate Zen, Nalanya. Our fate rests in your hands. Alright. So now we have to... Uh, I'm gonna actually try and focus a little bit on... Doing the de Is there nine charges of that now? Two. One. Nine charges. Huh. We'll show I feel like that's up for my glory of Okay. Well, um, I guess that's one way of doing the fight. <laughs> but, um, uh, it didn't seem to be a very effective way. <laughs> Alright. We'll show our king. And the rest of you power hungry imposters. There we go. The Druid learned you don't need to head in there so quickly. Alright. I'm actually doing a little bit of damage in this one. It's amazing. That just means this one's not going to go as quickly as the other ones have. These people must not be quite as high as some of the other groups I was in. That's okay. I mean, actually being able to play your class is kind of fun too. Alright. 
trying to think if I have anything that's actually useful for DPS. I think it's just these powers, right? Then go ahead and pop another uh, Earth Shield on. Not when you're trying to get 30 levels in an hour. Okay, we're we're taking the scenic route. We're enjoying the ride. I feel like you might as well just like level boost, you know, if if that's the mentality. But I I'm curious. Mostly, I'm wanting to do this from like a curiosity perspective to see just how fast you can level in an hour and a half. I don't think we'll get to 70, but it will be interesting to see how far we do get. Oh, I didn't know you could go over this way. That's cool. Learn something new every day. I thought you had to wait till they stopped, like, you know, or started bickering. Does that feel when you're ahead of the guy who stole the treasure? It's like, just follow us, we'll tell you where to stash it. I gotta make sure to grab the... This druid is trying to get himself killed. Like, tank too slow. I don't think it's tank too slow. Tank's faster than me. Alright. Continuing on. What a good tank. So nice. Oh yeah, I gotta actually loot it. That would be bad to forget to loot it. Alright, let's do some chain lightnings. I mean, even without rested, we've almost gained another whole level, so... I mean, it is kind of going fast. Why am I dying? I mean, obviously, because this guy is attacking me, but why is he attacking me when the tank's right there? Like, I'm just a lowly healer. Don't attack me. Get this one. I think we have one more after this. Hopefully... I think, is it down here? Or is it over there? I'm not sure. Oh, it's right there. Okay. I'll just grab this real fast. Then I can focus. Work complete. Alright. Now I can focus on attacking. I think so far this dungeon is the one that's lasted the longest. The other dungeons would have already been- I mean, to be fair, this one isn't a super short dungeon. Like, Storm Stout Brewery is really short. And same thing with Temple of the Jade Dragon. They're both very short dungeons. doing our thing. I'm mostly just keeping an eye on heal. Making sure I could drop a healing stream. Just to make sure people are getting healed. Get another lava burst going out there. I think I picked up a talent that said something about lava burst. I don't remember what it is. There's just one guy over there now. 
to do, Stormkeeper. Interrupt. Talk and roll. Alright, so now. Oh, yeah, we gotta go back up to the elevator. That everybody always misses. Run, run, run. I'm gonna miss it. Of course. I always miss it. Never have the, the right speed boost. It's okay. Coming back down yet? All right, it's coming back down. I like the elevators that you can manually uh, raise and lower because the automatic ones are kind of annoying. I like how they fixed uh, that one dungeon, the underwater dungeon that used to have the jellyfish you had to wait for, where you just portaled um, at will because that made life so much easier. Maybe one day they'll make uh, this dungeon into a Mythic Plus and then uh, it will have this the same functionality. All right, at least we're almost done. Cooldown on this is only a minute. I should probably use it a lot more often. I mean, for a healer, I'm not doing terrible DPS. This is almost like you almost don't even really have to think about what you're doing, though. It, it's it's. Just like questing, except for minus the story, really. And you have friends to help. But we made it to level 46. One level out of here with no rested. That's not bad. Alright. Go ahead and do some chain lightning and a lava burst. I'm only halfway keeping an eye on on health because like they're all dying. All the mobs are dying, none of us are dying. We might have to be careful here. We'll see. Will you unlock the first right. challenge me, peons? You will not the Stormkeeper. Go ahead and pop this down. That druid. You'll be dying. Whoops. Well, I mean I can't I can't heal line of sight. Y'all gotta get in my line of sight. Well oh, that was a one shot. I can't heal a one shot. can res them, but, uh, yeah. We'll just pop them both a heal. Oh, hello. All right. Farewell. We must retrieve the lantern, ballot, scroll, and bow before Zin and his clans uncover them. Travel safe. I will find a better hiding place for the four relics. Pandaria is indebted to you, Nalanya. Uh, no I hope problem. You again Truly again. a fight for the ages. I'm glad you're on our side, Nalanya. May your days bring you joy. All right, level forty-seven. Another one I need quests for. Are the watchers of the Lord. All right. The wall must die. So, um, kill wing leader Naranak. Where? All right, we got to catch up to people. Uh, the Mantid had laid siege to no uh, Nuazo Temple. 
even now, uh, wing leader Naromach and his forces worked across the final chasm. You must stop him before they reconstruct that bridge. Alright. Alright. These people, they do be dying. And my strength and a lot of you will soon wish you hadn't come All this right. way. Alright, let's go ahead and attack this guy. Everyone's dying so fast. I was... I, I cannot loot. I keep forgetting. I don't know why. You would think by now I would know, but no. I'm looking for my other quest. Whoops. Oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. I thought the I thought the tank was there. Whoops. That was completely my fault. They must have gone oh, they must have gone up higher. I see. I didn't know you could do that. Now we know. Alright, so where the tank is like way, way up there, right? I think that's what it is. The tank just like jumped over all over all of this stuff. Squish, right? Yeah, proof that I am in fact a healer, not a tank. But yeah, I think the tank just ran way far up. I don't think I miss saw that he was up here. I think he just didn't really have aggro or something. I don't know. Where is the exit? It's like right up here, I think. Uh, right? No, it's up further. Alright. Now, to be fair, I also wasn't paying that much attention, but you know. Eh, lesson learned. Have to pay sort of attention. Okay. All right, where was my it's other quest? Eight, um, we're still stuck in the middle of the entire let's landed see. army. Look out there. Too many for us to take head on. This hmm. one. I have a crazy idea. Well, Shadow Pan work, prisoners but free. We'll need your help here. Ah, that one might be difficult. Let's I sent a dozen of my best men ahead to infiltrate the Mantid siege. Look. None Get have returned. Since you are taking let's the fight directly to the Mantid, you will be in position to free any who had the misfortune to be captured. We'll you will do this. You like we'll dogs. try, but that Good. quest. If they skip all the mobs that, uh, like, all the cages are after this boss. But if they skip all those mobs, I'm not gonna be able to do that quest. Not in one run, anyways. Swarmers are coming up the ramp. Use the sap to slow them down. Alright. Come on. Oh, he's just gonna, like, jump down and do it. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess that's a way to do it. I'm gonna come... Come down here. Alright. Where? They were just down there fighting. Alright, but none of this, this stuff won't slow him down. I think it might still damage him. I'm not sure. But it definitely does not, um, slow him down. He'll just, yeah, he's just gonna zip through all that. Okay. I mean, you do you, sir. This is an interesting, uh... Really? Are you even trying? <laughs> that poor priest. Just get thrown up in the air and then one shot. Let's see. I don't even know who he's attacking. Alright, so now we'll res the priest again. I have never seen the fight done that way. I wonder what happens if you do it with, like, normal gear. Like, I imagine that would not work well uh, for you, but I don't know. Alright, so we can actually mount up here. Okay, they are going to 
release them, right? Alright. So that's good. We can at least get these guys. I don't know if we'll be able to get all of them. Because I know in the next room, you gotta, uh... That will open it. Can I open this one? Thank you. Alright, you gotta stand back. As he explodes it. We got everyone out of here, right? I think so. Well, but the next see, uh, room, you gotta like kill extra mobs. So. Whoops. Did I say thirty? I meant three. <laughs> uh, my mistake. Oh, hurry! You must stop the siege. All right. Maybe they'll do it. I think they all have the quest, so that'll be good. If if he releases them, I'm gonna just like. Unleash what I can. Since I can't do much else. I am not a damage dealer. Oh my gosh, that priest! That priest has like... No health. Oh, level 68, that's probably why. They get hit a whole lot harder than anyone else would. Makes sense. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. We got the boss now. And a whole bunch of mobs. That's gonna be interesting. All right, but we are now level 48, so that's a thing. I need the Stormkeeper. Oh. All right. At least we're just down to that. I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, release what guys I can. Let's see. We should get little bombs. Where are the bombs? Where are the bombs? He's not throwing... Oh. I'm like, where are the bombs? Alright, did I get... I don't think I got that guy. Attack shield. Did I get... Let's get another bomb when he throws it. There's one. Work complete. Alright, we got- I'm surprised. I'm really shocked that we got that. Can we still damage him with these? I don't know. We can try it. I don't know if it does much damage. It does! Actually, it did the most damage of everything I did. <laughs> I mean, I'll take it! Alright. Now, the blowback fight. Oh, we finally got heroism. I'm gonna definitely have to put that in a better place after this. Alright, I need to catch up to the tank wherever the tank is. Alright. I am stuck in amber. Alright, let's go ahead and drop a healing stream totem just because I keep getting stuck in amber. And I would rather not just immediately die. Alright. I hate this fight so much. Maybe we can kill him before he, like, starts doing his tornado thing. Maybe. Where is he? Did we break him? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, we beat him here. There we go. Have some heroism, guys. <laughs> Alright. Phase change. Ugh, oh, this part. No! I will do what Pavalak could not. 
I really love this fight so much. At least it got interrupted quickly. Alright. Easy. Yeah, I need to move this to over here, I think. That would be a good place. Alright. What is it? Masterfully done. We wouldn't have succeeded without you. Watch the shadows. Thirteen thanks I give you. Twelve for those rescued, and my own as well. Here's something else I give you in gratitude. Beware the West. The wing leader wind. lies dead and the siege is broken. You've saved the temple, Nalanya. We serve. And so we are now level forty-nine. So we have gained ten levels so far since since we uh started. And we still have a little bit more time to go. But let's go ahead and get our next set of talents uh, updated. But I think we'll probably get one more dungeon in. And then we're going to see what, how much boosted we get. So that's going to give us, it looks like, at least 11 levels from just doing the dungeon being fully rested. Um, which is not bad at all. I mean, you know, level 50 or 51, depending on what we get and how much experience we get, that's not going to be bad at all for just doing uh, dungeons in an hour and a half. Like, that's really, really good. And if you had uh, a guild group where you were just spam running them and you weren't even having to wait the little bit of time for a dungeon queue, that's going to go really fast because, I mean... It, it's the queues are not super long for a healer, but I mean here we are we've waited like a minute or uh, Two already yeah, a minute uh, Just under a minute Now we're at a minute so As opposed to instantaneously I Think this is another new dungeon though all right, so more quest experience. On the wall. Yes, this is the one I was talking about in the last dungeon. The wall must stand. Where you get to ride on the big bug at the end. All right, so let's look them up. Um. All right. The that's a big bug uh, achievement. Uh, the Mantid have something they call Rhygon. It's a giant bug they are using to bust down the wall's gate. Let's keep that thing from getting into the, into the, yeah, into the veil. Alright, and then the other one, Gate of the Setting Sun. We gotta light the signal flame. Uh, we need reinforcements. Someone has to fight through and light the signal flame. It's all up to you, Shaman. No pressure or anything. No pressure at all. All right, let's see if we can get past. We couldn't quite get past. That's okay. That's all right. All right. Get a little bit of uh, DPS going. I really need to get in there with them. I think they're already in there. Are they? I don't know. Maybe. Alright. Now, we will hop in there. I need to pop an earth shield on the tank. Not that anyone needs any kind of healing, but you know. I think the talent we picked up gives us extra charges for uh, flame shock, which is nice. Because it's, you know, helping our DPS go up. We're in here as a healer and we're third on the damage chart. That's either not bad for us or bad for the group. I don't know which. <laughs> Alright. Which way do we go out? We go out this way, right? Or, yeah, go out this way. Right? I think so. And then we gotta go... Yeah, because the, the boss is, like, down there. I think. Or, no. Still on a little way. We are running. Run! I'm just gonna follow the, the, the tank. We go where the, where the shield, the meat shield goes. Oh. 
I I don't have Spirit Walker's Grace yet. It would be nice if I did. Then I could just sit here and like cast on the run. But this will have to do. Catch up and then cast. Yeah, like I'm not doing too bad. I mean, I wish that the other DPS were up there with the tank so that, uh, because I'm the healer, I'm not supposed to be third on the chart. I'm guessing they're, yeah, they're higher level. I mean, I'm not super low level anymore, I'm level 49. So, I mean, it is a thing. Let me get on the elevator before they raise it. Alright. I am here. Bye! See you later! We're gonna go fight a boss and then we'll be right back. Alright. Have some lava for sure. Step. Watch your feet. Can I reach him? Hello. At least he's going down pretty quickly. Not bad at all. Alright, um, we're just running in the fire. We gotta light the signal. Signal? Uh, cannon, right? Don't we have to do something? I don't know. I thought we had to do something up here. We have to, like... Don't we have to, like, do this? I don't know. I feel like we do. Okay, at least that person is doing it. Because I was like, I don't ever do the mechanics. Like, I don't know what all the mechanics are for this dungeon. Because I never really ran it. But I'm pretty sure someone has to go do a thing up there. The gates are about to fall. But I could be wrong. I don't know. Alright. I think we're almost to the end of this one. Someone always does it before I can get to it. Yeah, like, it's one of those things of, um, I never have to worry about it. I think I stopped playing, well, I stopped playing in Pandaria, and so I didn't really do a lot of the in-game content. Um, so I'm not sure about, like, some of the mechanics in these dungeons. Like, the bosses, I, I know the boss mechanics. Um, but like that particular one, I'm not exactly sure what you're supposed to do. I just know what pops up on the screen where it says, hey, go shoot down these bugs. Oh, I'm like, okay, if you say so. Maybe it makes it easier, like maybe you don't get the fire or something, I don't know. I don't think it really matters for this, apparently. We're just blowing through it anyways. Alright. Now it's time to... I think it's time for the... Wait. Am I going the right place? I am, aren't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like... I was pretty sure this was the right area. Alright. Up on the post. Jump down. Alright. I'm gonna just let people that actually do damage get up there. And get that vulnerable spot right there. Come on, y'all can do it. I I am just gonna stay down here and uh, attack bugs. You can get up there and attack the big bugs. There's the weak spot. All right. Uh, we'll go ahead and hero. Run away! And done. Easy peasy. Level 50.
50? Alright, where do I turn my question at? Uh, right over here. Alright, so, let's we see. Couldn't have sword. done that better myself. Well, probably not. Uh, outstanding! Nelanya, your timing couldn't have been better. Be strong. If I didn't see it with my own eyes, I wouldn't have believed it. Great job, Nelanya! Alright, so we did. We got to level 51. Alright, so. So, we have upgraded our talents. We have uh, made sure all of our gear is up to date. What does the add-on say? The add-on says uh, that we still are missing 123.3 and not to open the mail. But I'm going to, I mean, I already wasn't uh, following the rules. Do we have any threads in there? We do have threads. What will happen if we do that? I'm curious. This is interesting. It'll pull all the threads out. How many threads are there? My goodness. There's, it's still going. Is it done yet? Okay, I think, I think it might be done. How many threads? W oh my goodness. That was a lot of threads. All right. Well, let's see what our cloak is going to. 304. We're just getting all kinds of stats for it. Goodness. It's a lot of a lot of thread. All right. So that gives us, oh, I see why. So when we first logged in, we only had a 101% experience gain. Now we have a 121% experience gain. So it automatically knocked that down uh, 115. It was 125 or something like that. So that's really cool. So then what happens if we do this, if we retrieve everything? I don't know if that actually, I guess the, I'm not sure what all exactly you get. I'm assuming there's even more threads. We couldn't even get all the threads. That's crazy. There's still threads. Seven threads in the mailboxes. Wow, there's even more threads. Let's see. I'm just super curious what this ends up being. More thread. I assume you would do this all at the end. But uh, I just want to see where where we end up at. Like, I'm not sure what exactly it is that gives you the XP. But, let's see. So now our cloak would be giving us 124%. Let's see. Retrieve the threads. We've got so much stuff. We've just got all this, all this equipment. <laughs> Oh, I see. Oh. It's experience you get for defeating a dungeon boss. Now I'm understanding. That's why you turn off the auto loot. Okay. Because then you uh, end up getting all of this experience for your cloak. And then when you do pick up those XP bonuses, it's going to be uh, a lot more more bang for your buck, basically. So many gems. And I see a thing we can do with one of our gems. We can unsocket this and then resocket the new crit. Alright, um... Alright, let's keep checking. 
Uh, any more threads? Okay, I think that's all the threads. What else do we got? Open all. I understand. Now I now I get it. Okay. Okay, so that's that's how you can level very fast. So you saw it. Uh, I can't carry any more of those. Oh, that's fine. So we were at level 51 and we opened all of our threads. The threads will increase our percentage uh, that we can earn for experience. Uh, we started uh, with 101% experience gain. After just the little bit we did, uh, we got up to 124 experience and we only did like four or five dungeons. Like imagine if we did like all the dungeons you were supposed to do and the raids and you just like did that for like three hours or so straight back to back to back to back to back. And then you opened up all those XP bonuses. I mean, we're now level 57. We gained uh, six levels just from doing that and we started at level 49 when we first, uh, oh no, excuse me, we started at level 39 when we first started this episode. I'm almost certain of that. Yeah, 39. So we almost gained 20 whole levels in an hour and a half. So I don't know, color me impressed. Like I now understand how it is done and that's pretty pretty darn impressive in my book so it can definitely be done you can definitely go from level 10 to level 70 like really fast if you follow this strategy gonna do that for my tunes exactly this is amazing like i was skeptical at first but having seen it in action like yeah you can definitely color me impressed uh i i would never have thought to do that so to recap what you do is you just make sure that auto loot is turned off um, and then you just don't loot anything you just run a bunch of dungeons a bunch of raids and stuff and you just let everything get sent to your mailbox and if you want that add-on that I had that was uh, the uh, remix mail helper so with that you can then pull all of the threads out and upgrade your cloak without taking those little XP bonuses. And then once you have the correct amount for uh, the, the cloak XP, which I don't know what it goes up to. I think I heard something like 200%, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Then you pull all those XP bonuses and boom, you're level 70. So that's definitely impressive. So if you like this kind of content, please make sure to like, subscribe, follow, share, all that good stuff. If you want to watch live or on Twitch at twitch.tv slash they are 27. I have my schedule posted in the about and in the description. And if you want to see which games we're playing each day, I post them on x.com slash they are 27. And I hope you join me in the next one. Until then, guys, bye.